Okay, I went on to the uh, Amazon website and I picked up these trackers, very similar to the uh, AirTags from Apple. They work only with iPhones and they also have a speaker inside. Now I'm gonna put these on my cars because I have to park on the street and we're in the driveway. And if somebody comes by the car or they realize there's an air tag on there, it's going to beep. So I want to remove that sound that the, the I guess, would be thief would be able to create to search for the air tag. And then this way I can hide it somewhere on the car. It'll make it much more difficult for them to find it. So these are actually easier to, uh, to uh, break into <clears throat> than the uh, air tags. You simply want to break open. Now, this is like three layers. You have the inner layer, which is on one side the battery case, on the other side the circuit board. You have a top cover with the button, and that button is going to line up with the brass or gold button right there at the top right. So it'll be very easy to put this back together again. The whole fits for a keychain. And so this would be the back cover, which houses the battery. This is the top cover, which uh, houses the uh, circuit board. And then again, you've got a central plastic case that carries the circuit board itself. So once you get this thing opened up, there's a rubber gasket right around the perimeter. And it's very difficult to get underneath, but if you work in between the plastic card case and the rubber gasket, you should be able to find a spot where you can get that um, screwdriver into place. Now it's gonna take a small screwdriver. I've already taken this out. There's a little bit of glue on it, which holds it in place. I'm just gonna put the camera down for a second. All right, there we go. Sorry about that. So there we go. We've got the circuit board. It's just held in with some, some very lightweight glue, which keeps it in place with the gasket to keep moisture out. But that is the speaker right there. And the speaker has a piece of green cellophane on it. In order to block the speaker from working, you don't have to rip anything out. I think like the AirTag has to. Those two gold pads right there on the lower left corner, those are your speaker contacts. That's your speaker. And all I'm gonna do is take some cellophane tape big enough to cover the the, uh, the speaker itself. Now the white part and the gold part are your contacts on the speaker. So put the tape over that portion. The green is already insulated, so you just need enough to cover the white and the gold. And then once you put this back together again, the speaker will be off. You haven't damaged anything and um, you should be ready to go. Now you're going to lose the beeps when you go to turn it on and off and and reset it, but you're just going to have to do some counting on it to, to make sure it, it tells you. It's like one second to on, three seconds to off, and seven seconds to reset. So just do your, your math on that. And once you put this back together, it should show up on your, your phone or your iPad, and you should be able to track it just like the, uh, the AirTag. Hope this helps.